Laura. Today I'm coming to you with the Dollar Tree haul. I found some really good stuff. I was so excited to see some of the things that I found. So I thought I would hurry up and get this filmed so I could share it with you. You're going to be seeing me in different areas in the next couple of weeks. I have mentioned to y'all that I am doing a little bit of a remodel in my home. So I'm having to go from room to room. So you're going to see a little bit of a different background. So just bear with me. It should be over with soon and I will share the process with you. Before we jump on into this haul, don't forget if you enjoy the content to give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. I will leave the stores that I go to listed in the description box. And don't forget to follow us on Facebook and Instagram and share with family and friends. Let's go ahead and jump on in to this haul in no particular order because this is a mess. I wish you could see the table. It is a total mess. Okay, so the first thing I purchased, which is not new to the Dollar Tree, is this big giant calculator. I bought a calculator there at least 15 years ago because I've been shopping at the Dollar Tree for at least 20 years. And my calculator finally went out. It went blah, blah, blah. So I had to pick up a new one. So I actually, I'm going to put the date on it so that I know later when this thing goes out. If it goes out, they're pretty good. That was the first thing I got. In the stationary aisle, they started to put the back to school stuff in already. So I picked up some new notebooks. And this is what they look like. Let me share them with you one by one. This one, of course, for my bright ideas. And look at, look at these guys, look, look at the pages. Aren't those cool? They're just blank with the, the pink lining in it. And then it is from the, the Jot brand. And then it just has the cool light bulb there. I thought that was pretty cool. And then the, this one that says Optimist. And this one has yellow on the inside and it's just black on the on the back and the front and then the bee bulb I thought the colors were really really super nice and I like the way they matched up the blue with the cover here I thought that was pretty nice and they feel the covers feel really nice and thick they feel you know like it's I would have paid more than a dollar for it you know because it feels really nice so I picked up these three when I went, they were starting to get, like I said, a bunch of school supplies in already. And they had their carts full with boxes, but I didn't have time to stay and see what else there, but I will go again tomorrow. Okay, the next thing here in front of me, I was able to score some Betty Crocker Easy Seal Bonus Storage containers. So I picked these little ones up. These are a great size to have. These are for a 1.5, one and a half cup and you do get, it is a bonus buy, so you do get four for the package. So always look for that bonus buy. And I also found them in this other size here. And this is for a, this is for two cups, a two cup measurement. This one also comes with four containers. And these last pretty well. I'm always buying these, you know, because I give stuff away that I cook and, you know, I give my containers and the ones that I do keep, they last real well. So I really, really like them. And a one really random product, since I am moving from one room to the next room, having to pack things up, they do have this Jot Protective Wrap Film Protector. I had been buying the one from Walmart to pack all my dishes and stuff, but I saw this there and I said, well, let's give it a try. Let's see how it works. I'm sure it's not the best, guys, but you know, in a pinch, they have it there. I was very, very surprised and very happy to see it there. This next product, I have seen a lot of girls hauling them. These are the Sphere Ice Molds, okay? And I don't know if you can see that. A lot, of, I'm gonna open one of them. I did pick up two of these, and I'm gonna tell you why I picked them up. A lot of people were buying them for the chocolate molds during the holidays. What it is, it's a two piece. Let's take it apart here. And then you just fill up your uh, the water here, and then you just cover it with this side. And then you just flatten it out, insert the top, pop it in the freezer, and you'll have some big giant round ice cubes. Now the reason that I got these 
I have ice cube trays. I have ice in my dispenser, my refrigerator. But during the summer, I like to make the big jugs of the agua frescas, the watermelon or the cantaloupe or the honeydew water. And if you make a jug, if you put the smaller ice cube, it starts to dilute pretty fast. And with these, you know, it'll stay cold and not dilute so quick. So I thought these were a good buy. So I did get two of these. Okay, some home decor that's in front of me. These were new, they were putting them out as I was there. Look at how pretty these are. They have the gray, the white, and the black. I don't know if you can see the gray color there with the white. It is a green briar product. So I picked up two of these because this is gonna be my actual colors for my new uh, living room and stuff, the black, the white, and the gray. So it's gonna fit in just right. And I've been getting really lucky finding stuff to, to put on my bookshelves and stuff. And on the theme of home decor, you're not gonna believe your eyes when I show you this next product. I'm gonna see if I can pick them all up at the same time. Look what I found. Diffusers, can you believe what the Dollar Tree is doing to us? This one is Pink Amber Poppy, and it is one fluid ounce, and it is called a Reed Diffuser. Pink Amber Poppy. I'm gonna open one up so you can see it. It does have the liquid and it does have the little wooden sticks. Okay, the next one is Wild Apple and Ashwood, and it looks like that, it's orange. And then this is Beachy King. And then Wild, oh my goodness, I picked up two. I must have not seen that. I picked up two of the Wild Apple and Ashwood. That's okay. Uh, and the last one is a Raspberry Prosecco. I'm gonna open this one so we can take a look at it so you can see the size of the jar and the little sticks. And this is what the actual product looks like. Pretty nice design there. And then the little sticks, you get seven little wood sticks. And let's take a sniff, let's see what it smells like. Oh wow, this is very, very nice. Very soft, but still it has, it has some throw on it. But I guess I'm gonna have to try them and let y'all know in a later video to see how, how well, you know, they, the reach is on these. So I thought that's pretty nice. I mean, this would make a really nice gift for somebody. You know, give them a little home decor, home scent kit. That's pretty nice. I was happy to find these. That's the, all the collection that they had right now. I don't know if there's any more. If there are more, and you know, let us know in the comments so we can be on the lookout for them. Hey guys, and I really want to thank y'all for whoever gives the videos a thumbs up. I really appreciate it, and I want you to know how much that really helps me out here on the channel. So thank you for all the thumbs up. Okay, you're not going to believe this one either. I couldn't even believe this one. Look at what they're adding to our Dollar Trees. Onesies for newborns. I I have no use for these. These are going to be a donate item for me. These are by the Briscoe Baby, Briscoe Brands. Let me see if it says a size on there. It says for 12 months. The little gray one is a, for 12 months. But look at how nice these are. And they're actually soft. So they're at, they feel like good quality little onesies. Like you could make a really nice gift for somebody for a baby shower. And this one is for, the pink one is for six months and they call it rabbit skins. That's what they call the little onesie, makes sense. So here's the pink, aren't that the cutest? I mean, uh, Dollar Tree is just really hitting it out of the park with these things, you know? Not, not everybody can afford to go out and buy a, a $10 onesie. I mean, these things are not cheap and at Target and places like that, you know? And here you can get two of these for $2. I mean, like, just blows your mind. I can't even, I can't get over this. So, like I said, these will be a donate item for me. All right, a couple of more home decor items. I'm going to be making a couple of DIYs with my new decor and I, I scored big I think with these new items that they have. They have these new rocks, they're calling them Stones Decorative Accents and they're black. 
So I was over the moon about these. So I did pick up two of these because I'm going to be making like some vases with the stones at the bottom and then put some little uh, plants in the middle and stuff. So, or just to put in some vases with just a single flower. I think that looks real pretty. So I got those for that. And then they also had these, uh, they're calling them decorative stones. And these are white. And they almost have a little bit of a, of a shine to it. Not too much. I'm going to try to bring you as, as close as I can. But they are pretty, pretty nice. So I did pick up two of these also. You get a large amount. Let me see if does it say how much. You get 32 ounces. So, you know, two pounds. That's a pretty good amount for a dollar, I thought. Okay, I'm going to jump into some food items that I found. I finally, I've seen some of the girls hauling these. They're the Special K Pastry Crisps, Strawberry Pastry Crisps. And you get four for a dollar. These are very good. I've already tried these and they are delicious. So there, it's a nice little breakfast bar or a snack bar to have. And it is a name brand, so I was pretty happy about that. In the candies and cookies, I got me two of the Heath bars. There are five bars per bag. And this is uh, five, 0 0.5 ounces. So it's a total of a 2.5 ounce package. Two of these, and these are delicious. I finally decided to get these. I heard so much stuff about them. The oven baked fudge mint cookies. I have heard through the Dollar Tree grapevine that these taste exactly like the Girl Scout mint cookies. So we're gonna give these a try and let's see if they are because I used to love those cookies. I have not purchased them in a while. So I thought I would pick these up and see if they really do taste like it. I'm sure they do if they say so. And then I got, of course, some more bubble gum. I always get the cherry if they have it. I got two bags of the double bubble cherry bubble gums. Okay, two of those, I love them. And then they finally came out with my all time favorite grape. These are delicious. I'm sure I know they're not good for you, but I just love them. And grape is my favorite. So I was happy to find that. So I'm, that, these are gonna go into one of my candy jars. Okay, and the last item we have, guys, for this haul are these First Harvest Peach Halves. Let me show you how big these cans are. Look at that. It is 29 ounces of peaches. So I did pick up two of these. These are new to the Dollar Tree. They are distributed by Simcoe Foods in Los Angeles. And it is a product of South Africa. So I thought that was pretty, pretty nice, these big old cans of peaches. It's about time for some peach cobbler, I think, on my next recipe on my cooking channel. I think that was all. Let me make sure I didn't forget anything. I thought there were some pretty cool finds today. Let me know what your favorite is. And if you want me to be on the lookout for a certain product, let me know in the comment and I will be out there trying to locate them. I think that's going to do it for us today, guys. I surely hope you enjoyed the haul. I love bringing them to you. Don't forget, thumbs up, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.